DMX via Ethernet allows you to make use of third-party manufacturers DMX distribution systems. DMX via Ethernet has several advantages, one of which is its high flexibility. DMX splitters are no longer required as DMX universes can be routed remotely to whichever DMX output node required. Another advantage is that backup consoles can automatically take over communication with a DMX via Ethernet node if there is a problem with the main console. This eliminates the need for swapping cables at the rear of the console in a hurry. To configure the console for DMX via Ethernet, press the tool's hard key and then the DMX and NSP configuration soft key. Once the dialog window is open, you can choose DMX via Ethernet by pressing the soft key. The Graname range can support multiple DMX via Ethernet protocols at the same time. For example, it is possible to send Universe A to an artistic license Netlinks OP DMX output node using Artnet while sending Universe B to a Pathway Pathport DMX node using the Pathport protocol. Using the protocol soft keys, you can select which protocol you want to send for each DMX universe. Currently, there are three available Artnet, Port All, and Pathport. Consult a manual of your DMX via Ethernet node to see which protocol it uses. By pressing the configuration soft key next to the required universe, you will open a new dialog window that automatically detects any compatible DMX via Ethernet nodes connected to the console. You can then select which node and which output on that node will be outputting the currently selected universe. Each of the protocols is configured differently and has different options as the notes themselves are very different.